let's uh, let's uh, explain to our audience mm. what's a working set mm. working set mm. let's start with the warm up we yeah. have warm up mm. you have working sets mm. you have top sets uh-huh. we have uh, back off sets mm. and you have accessory and you have others like super set mm. tri set and pyramid set mm. you know? mm. let's start with the major ones we warm up set and working set mm. warm up set mm. it is any set that is below your working set mm. any set that it's in meant preparation to, to prepare you for, for the whatever main. thing you're about to do mm. it also helps you to f- that is the moment you focus on your on your form mm. speed which is power mm. and also focus on just performance mm. focus on making every rep look similar to your warm up sets mm. you get it mm. it is very different mm. if you're doing strength mm. how you warm up for strength it is different from how you warm up for size No. I don't know if you understand. I understand. If you are warming up for strength, mm. anything less than or below what, your what you're supposed set. to work with. Yes, the percentage warm up. you're supposed so to work with. It, it's or in case you're supposed to work with uh, 90 kilos, mm-hmm. anything below 90, 90 kilos or 90%. Yeah, 90%. Uh-huh. You're supposed to work with 90%. Mm. So anything below 90%, it's a warm up imagine. It's a warm up. Yes. Okay. So when you are doing strength, mm. you're starting with let's say 60% for instance. Uh, okay. 60% mm. if you do plus plus 5 on every week uh, for 4 weeks. Uh, this is a 5% increase. Yes, 5% every week, increase okay. every week for 4 uh, weeks. You land to 60 65 70 75. Uh, Anything less than 75 uh, will be more of hypertrophy. Oh. We'll be focusing on uh, building muscles. What's up hypertrophy? Hypertrophy is building muscle size. So you are so you're starting with 65 because you must have a program mm. so i'm assuming your program will start at 65 or 60 percent you're increasing five percent every week mm. you will find out you're even doing high reps mm. you'll start maybe with 12 reps mm. so doing strength training doesn't mean we normally neglect 12 reps mm. eight reps mm. the way we normally do for hypertrophy it depends with the program eh? it depends with the program uh. but this repetition of mention mm. will help you to focus on your last cycles mm. of your program because okay. maybe your program is, is it, it it does have like three cycles mm. so it has hypertrophy mm. endurance hypertrophy and now strength mm. so these two phases hypertrophy and endurance mm. will prepare you for your main phase which is the strength phase mm. you get mm. every week you have initial warm up working set will be your working set every mm. week mm. so if your working set was 80% mm. Anything below 80% mm. is warm up. So we we've, we've, we've talked about warm up, mm. then working set. Yeah. Then now top set. Top set. It's part of working set. Top set is your heaviest set. Mm. So your heaviest set could be let's say you're doing three sets mm. of working set, three mm. working sets of maybe three reps. Three reps. Still. Uh, maybe your last set will mm. be your heaviest. Mm. That will be your top set. Still part of the working set or it can be your heaviest set mm. but you're not doing you're doing one set but yeah. your top set yes your, your, that's the top set your last set because you'll do heavier than other sets than the others or oh. you'll feel like uh-huh. that last set mm. was, was like blood set and sears this is a basically strength this strength strength training program mm. so after a top set we go to after a top set we have back off set back off set now is mm. where you do a deload mm. you've done your major work uh-huh. you decided to reduce some weights from the bar mm. changes to back off because you have reduced some maybe you can reduce 20% 15% even 50% mm. when you reduce you either increase the reps you can now play around with this progressive overload you can reduce tempo mm. you can increase reps mm-hmm. you, know, uh. you can increase speed mm-hmm. you, know, you can increase something like that oh, that's, a, the, that's a back off set that's a back off set mm. you have done doing your three reps uh. have reduced Mm. maybe from 80% uh. to 60% or 65 or 70 anything less than that yep. you go all out you mm. can decide to do 15 reps you know why we normally do that mm. because mm. there's one thing guys need to know when you focus so much on strength mm. what will happen you might lose endurance mm. because you're used to five reps yeah the time I, if i give you 200 kg mm. which is your 100% mm. you do it easily But if I give you 140 I tell you go for 15 you start punting at mm. your sixth rep. Mm. You're trying to prevent that by doing back off. Oh the back you off. Back set. off. Yeah. You aim for endurance mm. for muscle endurance. You back off you do lighter. You do a lighter. You do more reps. You do more reps. After back off set 
after back off set now mm. those are the major oh, those sets are the major sets for strength for strength training but it doesn't mean uh. you cannot apply that in hypertrophy oh.